Collingwood defeat Melbourne. Uh, your brother plays in this game. Not for gets, long. Yeah. Gets knocked out. Yep. Uh, we talked about that a little bit with Scoey. So Maynard's jumped in the air, yep. turned his body, yep. bumped your brother in yep. the head, yep. knocked him down. What's your thoughts? Um, well, initially my thoughts were he'll, he'll get weeks for it. It's um, You can't jump, turn your shoulder in and knock someone in the face and not get weeks. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see what happens and whether or not they follow through with that. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, I was pretty shocked watching it i was upset and a bit rattled because of his concussion history and all the rest yep. of it but yeah I, I don't know i mean it's in the heat of the moment you everything's happening so quick but you can you can protect someone in that moment i i, I mean i heard kane corn say that how's he meant to protect himself i'm like that's a fucking stupid argument mate <laughs> like that is the dumbest argument ever finals footy yep i know you want to be intent i know you want to be physical but you can protect yourself and protect the person you're about to hit in the face I think he could have easily done that. I said it on the show to Footycast before. I'm not sure if you remember that one. Stephen Adams in the basketball could have, got, oh, could yeah. have let a guy die, but caught him and caught him. laid him to the ground. He could have very easily gone this to protect him like that or that, maybe even rolled himself the other way, but instead put his arms up, ducked his shoulder, turned in and hit him straight in the face. So yep. I think he'll get weeks. Because um, even if he just jumped straight up right and f like yeah. fully bodied him front ways, yeah. you'd... So if, that, if, if he did that and continued with his mother and Angus got knocked out by accidentally hitting his shoulder or something, then that's just, yeah. that's the way. Yeah. But he's turned his arm and, and hit him straight in the face. So it'll be a massive line in the sand moment for the tribunal this week. Yeah. If they, if they, if they call it off and say he's good to play and this is a football act, well then they can never feasibly ever again say that the outcome is affected and it's, yeah. it's the action. And if they ever do that, well then they're just a fucking joke of a system. Cause, cause football action can then just a football action is a bumper tackle of, you know, yeah, anything, exactly. anything is a football action. Then, yeah. um, it's like the, uh, the, the Ricky Gervais stand up and, uh, the insurance company doesn't pay out of an act of God. Have you seen that? Uh, yeah, <laughs> fucking yeah. hilarious. Yeah. That's the same thing. Yeah. If they rule this out as a football action, well then they're just a fucking joke of a system and it should never, nothing should ever go to the tribunal again. Um, yeah, oh, I think he should get weeks. So I did see something, pr um, like, you know, Twitter's a horrible place generally, but I saw someone talk about, um, it was a Collingwood fan and he was saying, um, that Angus should have seen it coming and do and like dodged him. Yeah. From, <laughs> yeah. And like, and the fact that, um, that he maybe got a head knock earlier in the game showed that, that, um, that was the real time he got concussed and that he didn't make the right decision because he was already concussed. Yeah. Well, like the, yeah. the, the things that people come up with. Collingwood fans are very loyal and want to like, <laughs> yeah. want their team desperately to go ahead. And Braden Maynard is a very big part of that. Yep that team so i can understand why they're um why they're wanting to afl make a shitload of money off finals ticket sales and collingwood will sell out every game so yeah. they're obviously they have a vested interest in it same way that they let patrick cripps off for winning a brown low because they needed him to win it um yeah there's a little yeah. bit happening there i think and they're very i think they'll be very staunch on the fact that they will try and get him off and it's it'll be up to for whatever fucking reason it'll be up to i don't think it'll be up to fucking uh, Braden maynard's lawyers to get him off i think it'll be I think they're going to try their best to do it. And as a system, they'll try and let him off. But I think it'll be a, an injustice if he doesn't get... Weeks. Zero weeks would have to be... Like, it has to either be three or zero. Three or zero, yeah. It can't be in between. <clears throat> yeah. Um, if he misses two... So how many games does Collingwood have left? Two, they got right? two more games. Yeah. So, yeah. There's no way it can be one week. If they're no. going to give him any weeks, it'll be three or zero. Yep. So, you know, we'll see. It'll be fucking interesting. And it'll really turn the tribunal on its head for the rest of time what if he gets off.